It began like any other day at the secret headquarters of TNT, where superhero Network Man was really late for work and suffering a serious wardrobe malfunction. As he makes his way into the building, his superhero super senses suddenly sense something. I sense that somehow today is going to be different. And so it began. Network man, wait, help. There's a user in South Africa and he can't access his computer. What on earth can I do? This sounds tricky. What do we always do in this instance? I know. Time to turn it off and turn it back on again. Meanwhile, in the TNT Superhero Service Center, Hexray was searching the network for viruses. And Crypto was using his three hands and 15 fingers to reinstate passwords across the globe. Captain Hard Drive was looking hard in orange, while Serenity remained calm for users all across the globe. And not forgetting... Sorry I'm late guys, the M42 is an absolute nightmare. Network man. When you saw what undercrackers to wear, then I got me... Meanwhile in the server room, the new cleaner Doris was about to cause international chaos while searching for a PowerPoint for her vacuum. They were headed for global IT meltdown. But at least they would have clean floors. And then last night, I think I had a dodgy meal. Suddenly, a dodgy the It's All Hit the Fan phone rang. Good day, this is Sheila in Australia. We've lost power to all our network. It was the same story all across the world as one by one the networks fell. It's the same in the UK, total IT meltdown. We can't do this on our own. We need teamwork. Let's join forces. And so they combine their strengths. Could, because we've just saved the world. Superheroes, they should try doing my job. But one thing remains true at the TNT Service Centre. They don't need costumes to be superheroes.